defense grid. I see it. Seven ahead! Two of them! Sergeant, I got a visual on the defense grid turrets.
our position. Aerial! Sergeant, we need backup! Hang in there! Defense grid, Commander. Good. That HK will accompany you. Proceed forward. Remember, this is not over yet. Check your fire! That tank is ours!
Moving now! Commander, what's going on? The 124 destroyed the Central Core and stopped Skynet. So is the war over? For some of us, yes. But just before we destroyed the Core, Skynet managed to send three Terminators back in time. The only thing in our power now is to send the Protectors to meet them. Protectors? The ones that will assure the safety of the people marked for termination. The first Protector has to be Sergeant Kyle Reese. He'll go after the T-800 that's targeting my mother as we speak. By killing her, Skynet will try to erase me from ever existing. The second one will seek to destroy the T-1000. T-1000? A Terminator made of mimetic polyalloy, sent back to kill me as a child. A single prototype, created by Skynet. It's too powerful for a single human being. That's why we'll have to send a Terminator of our own. Do you have that CPU that Mac reprogrammed? No, I don't. You don't? Then we've got a problem. I don't believe any of our soldiers are capable of stopping the T-1000. We'll have to find another way, and we have to do it soon. Then, there's the matter of the infiltrator that was sent after you. The war can end for you right now, but the question is, are you willing to sacrifice your future? to protect your past. By being here, you've already proven that this is not beyond your capabilities. But I'll leave the decision up to you. Will I be able to fix my past mistakes? I always believe that the future's not set. There's no fate but what we make for ourselves. You do have the power to change it, and protect the ones you care about. So, what will it be then? I'll do it.
Let us begin then.